Would you like to have a redeem like this on your stream? I'm only giving you... I'm going to give you a quick guide on how I made this redeem. First, you're going to want a program called Mix It Up, where you can find a download link below. Once you have everything set up, you're going to want to open the little hamburger, click Twitch Points, and then create new channel point reward. The objective is to get the redeem to show over everything and mute your input and audio output. This will also create a reward on Twitch's end, where you can edit the amount and the cooldown on the redeem as well. Let's start with the easiest step, getting the video on your stream. There's a few ways to accomplish this, but I prefer having the video in a folder in OBS. This way you can green screen the video if need be, which is what I've done with this redeem. Go into OBS, create a new media source, and name it whatever you'd like. Remember the name of the source in OBS as you will need this later. Then just be sure to browse your computer and find the video you'd like to add for the source. If you need to add a chroma key to your video, simply go to filters and then chroma key. It defaults with green, but you can change it to any color you like. Now, in order to hear the redeem, you're gonna wanna go to the advanced audio properties and change it to monitor and output. This way, both you and your audience can hear the redeem. Hide the source in OBS for now. Now back to mix it up. You want to click the action options and then find streaming software and click the plus. You want to select your streaming software, in this case OBS. The action will be source visibility and then enter in the source name from earlier. Check mark that the source becomes visible. By clicking the play button, you should now see the video becomes visible in OBS. Now, in order to have the video become invisible, go back to mix it up and in the action, click wait. You'll want to make this wait as long as the video is in seconds. In this example, the video is approximately 13.9 seconds long. Then copy the streaming software action and then switch the new one to invisible and make sure it comes after the wait action. You'll need to go back into OBS and create some filters. Select the limiter option and then name it whatever you'd like. In this example, I'll be naming it volume. And then turn the threshold as low as it'll go. Now turn the option to hidden. Now copy the filter. Now go to the filters of the other option and paste in the filter. Go back to mix it up and you want to create a new streaming software action. Select the same streaming software option, the source name of your input or output, and the action will be source of filter visibility. And the filter name from before in this example will be volume. Set the visibility to on, and this will come before the wait action. You can drag and drop the action to put it before wait. Now make a copy of the action and drag it before wait, but name this one after the other audio source. Now duplicate both the input and the output actions, put them after the wait, but then turn the visibility to off. Congrats, your redeem should now mute you so you get the full interrupting experience. You wanna change the redeem on Twitch's end to give it a cooldown, otherwise you'll have them overlapping, which will not work out well. Also, be sure to click save at the bottom so you don't lose all your progress. If you want to see more examples of the redeems, you should stop by my Twitch. You can find a link in the description. Hope to see you there.